Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the flywheel key in your leaf blower, make sure the engine has cooled and the on-off switch is in the off position. We recommend performing this procedure with little or no fuel in the tank. Set the leaf blower on its side and use a T27 Torx bit to unthread the four screws, securing the fuel tank retainer. Set the fuel tank and retainer aside. Next, unthread the nine screws, securing the two halves of the blower housing. Detach the cable and static discharge wire from the housing retaining clip. Unthread the screw to fully release the discharge wire from the engine. You can now separate the two halves of the blower housing. Next, unthread the four screws securing the blower fan. Remove the fan. Remove the wire and boot from the spark plug. Use a three-quarter inch socket or a spark plug wrench to unthread the spark plug. Confirm that the engine piston is in the down position. Then insert a cord into the cylinder to prevent the piston from moving. You can now use a 17 mm socket to unthread the flywheel mounting nut. Remove both washers. If you don't have an appropriate size flywheel puller, you can re-thread the nut loosely so it rests at the top of the motor shaft. Set a 19 mm or similar size socket on the top of the motor shaft. Reposition the blower fan. Then thread and tighten two mounting screws until you hear the flywheel become dislodged. Be aware the blower fan may be damaged when using this method. Remove the blower fan. Unthread the nut and you can remove the flywheel. If still intact, remove the old flywheel key. Install the new flywheel key by inserting it into the notch in the motor shaft. Reposition the flywheel on the motor shaft until it sets into place. Replace the two washers. Then thread and tighten the mounting nut. Remove the cord from the cylinder and re-thread the spark plug. Be careful not to damage the plug by over-tightening. Reattach the wire and boot. Realign the blower fan. Confirm the four washers are in place. Then re-thread the mounting screws.
rejoined the two halves of the blower housing. Rethread the screw to secure the static discharge wire to the engine. Secure the discharge wire and the cable in the housing retaining clip. Rethread all of the screws to secure the two halves of the housing. Realign the retainer on the fuel tank. Then reposition the assembly on the frame. Confirm that the washers are in place on the screws. Then thread the four screws to secure the retainer. Refill the fuel tank if necessary and your leaf blower should be ready for use.